There will be no pity for those who show hostility to the Islamic Republic. Those are the words of Iran's president, Ibrahim Raisi, as anti-government protests pass the 100-day mark. Speaking at an event for 400 soldiers killed during the Iran-Iraq War of the 1980s, Raisi blamed enemies of the nation for recent public anger. On Monday, the wife and daughter of Iranian football legend Ali Dai were reportedly prevented from leaving the country when their Dubai-bound flight was forced to land on an Iranian island. Dai, a former national team captain, has criticized the government for using repression to clamp down on protests. Nationwide rallies were sparked by the death of Marsa Armini in September. She died in police custody after she was arrested for allegedly wearing her headscarf incorrectly. So far, the Iranian government has executed two people since protests erupted. Rights groups fear that there will be more.